You are not people who add value when you say want to go for leave. They say don't go, we pay you, but sit down. True or false? But when everything you are fighting, everywhere they are come, they just approve your leave. They say go, 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 go. Let the remaining one let them work together. Because you are not adding value. A redundant person is always prone to a layoff anytime there is opportunity for layoff. That is why everybody who is a servant must struggle to serve. Contribute your quarter. So that when you are not there, they say, hey, if this young man were to be here, this thing wouldn't have been like this. If this sister were to be here, this thing wouldn't be like this. They'll be calling you, when are you coming? When are you coming? When are you coming? You see, that is how people who are active in a system are being mixed when they're not there. So that you apply for a leap. They say, okay, go, 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 go. Don't be jumping here and there. I'm favored, I'm favored. That's not favor. You are redundant. That's why they give you quickly to go. Tonight, may God open somebody's understanding that in the kingdom of God, God does not only need your availability because you can be available and yet be redundant. There are some who are available doing nothing. There are some who are available that every minute is actually something good. They are adding to it. Glory to God. Tonight, may your availability add to the kingdom. May your availability add to the kingdom. May you not be redundant in a way that the heavens and the hosts of heaven will be looking for how to send you off from the system. Come on, let me hear your loudest amen. Say me, I will, be I will not be redundant anymore. Say it again, I will not be redundant anymore. I will be active, adding value to the system. Come on, if you are doing that, let me hear your loudest amen. Yeah. Let me hear your loudest amen. Yeah. And he says something about love. He said, one cannot love God and not love his house. And he went ahead and told us, some fellows are not in church tonight. But where are they? Is it that they are busy in the offices? No. They are hanging in the pool houses. Huh? Hanging somewhere doing nothing. And I put on my note here. I say interest is the greatest factor for a show of love. Interest. 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 Anything you love, you will show interest for it. You love food. Check it. You will show interest there. Are you with me? You need to see some fellows when they want to eat food. Oh boy. Blessed memory of John O'Carfer, who just died, was buried some few days ago. Have you seen that man eating food before? Sir, if the food is not sweet and you eat, I mean, you see O'Carfer eating it, and you, you would like to eat the food. He has interest for food. There are some also you like football. Also, Premier League won't let you rest in the house. That is where your interest is. So for those who love God, no matter where they are, they are coming to the house of their lover. The man you love, his house is never too far. Anywhere that man is, you are going there. You can trade there, no bother. Are you here? Am I speaking to someone here? Some of us are about to get married. Your wife will be somewhere very far. And grandmother, and grandmother, now you get to the place eh? after you finish discussion as we're about going she will escort you to one corner and then after she finishes escorting as she's going back you escort again you remain on that game because you are your interest is there you are a lover so if God is not touching your heart you can't be in his house forget it those who came this night is a show of interest I love this God, so I must show my interest for him. That's why you are here. Those who they are not here, they are not lovers. I wrote something here while he was talking to us. Listen to me. I said, for those who love God, listen to me. The interest for God's house will show. Now look at what I said here. I said, forget it. While he was speaking to us. You know what? I said, I love God is a language that anybody can speak. It's a language that anybody can speak. But the interest shows where you will be when it is service time. That is interest. I love God. It's a language anybody can speak. Anybody can say it. But the interest 
will show where you will be when it is time for service. You are here today because you show that interest to God. May your interest return back to you with a blessing. May your interest return back to you with a blessing. Now, I'd like you to stretch your hand towards this communion table tonight. Lord, I have come to partake. I have come to drink of the blood of Jesus. Whatever is not good for me, whatever disturbing my life, whatever disturbing my peace, whatever harassing me in any way, Lord, financially, in any way, Lord, by the blood of Jesus tonight, I cause them to their roots.